This long stretch of hot weather is also hard on those who are homebound and may not be able to seek out cooling supplies. That's where volunteers become an important lifeline. Fox Wars Alex Boyer joins us with that. Hi, Alex. Hi, Clarice. That's right. You know, for many of these residents, a volunteer might be the only person they interact with all day long. So these volunteers don't just drop off food. They spend uh, several minutes with each one of the clients, asking them questions, making sure they're okay. They start their day early, loading coolers filled with food into trucks for delivery before it gets too hot. Through their Meals on Wheels program, the Visiting Nurse Association of Texas helps to feed thousands of inbound residents. Meals on Wheels. But their mission doesn't stop there. Boxed fans have become part of the summertime delivery. I brought you a fan too. So I know, I know that the heat, with the hot weather, bringing you this, okay? So it's just one of those floor, you sit on the floor and just plug it in, okay? This brutal stretch of triple digit temperatures has do gooders like Chris Kulak asking questions. Did you say that you're doing okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just trying to stay cool. Yeah. Okay. 93 year old Margaret Chovanek lives alone. She stays inside most of the time, especially this time of year. My mother always said, wait a minute, we got August yet. And we're only in mid July. Yes, sir. Kulak and his co-worker Robin Plotkin want to make sure she and others on their route are taken care of. Our clients are kind of the most vulnerable there are out there. And so for them to be able to have a fan or to be able to have air conditioning or to be able to pay their bills, this is a tough time of year for them. It's the same for 84-year-old Betty Aguilar. How are you? Oh, okay. Good. And you? You're doing good? Uh-huh. Staying cool? Oh, she has trouble seeing and doesn't venture out far from her apartment. Real early. I get up at 4, 4.30 in the morning, but I come out around 6, 6.30. I walk to the mailbox and all the way there, you know, just around here. By mid-morning, she's back inside. You want to get out early, right? Oh, yeah, before it gets hot. Kulak says it's important for his volunteers to take precautions too. Many are out delivering five days a week. Everybody picks up a route. We also have a bottle of water in there. Staying hydrated so they can continue to help the people who count on them. You take care, okay? And you keep on looking tart. I'll try. How's that? I'll do that just for you. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. okay. You have a great day. And you know, last year, the VNA in Dallas handed out 400 boxed fans. Uh, so far uh, this year, they've handed out about half that amount. But as 93-year-old Margaret pointed out, we still have to get through August.